Yo YouTube, what is going on? Welcome to the Jeep and Daily channel. And, this guy is... and there goes the Jeep. <laughs> Stay tuned to figure out what happened.
hard driver. You going this way or that way? Good. I think it might have actually been your uh, your tow hook. Come this way, come this way. There's a big rock. Big drop. Well, guys, it's 10.30. We started wheeling at like 8, 8.30. We're on a black trail right now, and we're trying to figure out a game plan, but I don't know if you can see that, but that is fuel. So I got three quarters of a tank left for now, but I have to go take this thing back. I mean, it sucks. I didn't really get much video of this thing off-road, but... It is what it is. I'm just really bummed out because I just spent $600, $700 on all this stuff for the rear bumper. I don't really have the money to play with this stuff right now. And then I spent the $50 to wheel actually 60 because I paid for my brother also. So I paid $60 to wheel today, but I'm gonna have to figure out a game plan, get this thing back and hopefully come back out with somebody else. I wish I knew this guy's name that's helping me out here, but I don't, but if I figure it out, I'll be sure to shout him out. But he is, I'm following him back on some blue trails back to the parking lot. And we're going to come down in his Jeep and meet back up with the group and continue to wheel because I don't want my day to be over quite yet. But it is what it is. I'm bummed out, like I said, but that's only because I just spent so much money on this rear tire carrier and everything for it and stuff. But... That's the price you pay when you wheel with stock parts. Things tend to break, especially when they're old and rusty and you don't really take care of them. But if something cool happens on the way back, I'll be sure to try my best to record it. But if not, we're gonna get back out on the trail in an hour or two. Just because we have a ruptured gas tank does not mean the Jeep's still not a badass crawling rig the way she is second gear and four low and she's just crawling right up this stuff i mean i mean it hurts to see her end the day early being the one that breaks i mean it's not really broken it's driving off the trail but it's gonna have to be towed home because i'm probably gonna spend 80 dollars in fuel just to get home i don't care if you do it but i don't want you doing it and then two months later trade trade doors <laughs> It's the same thing for um, just even standing outside of a vehicle to being in it.
very tempting to drive through, but I, one, don't have my Jeep, and two, the snorkel has holes all throughout the tube anyways. Yeah, it's a Rubicon. They're not engaged though. It doesn't look like it. Yep. See if they can get you over. Look at that. guys this is where the five speed xj resides ah, it's heartbreaking it's still pouring gas i mean it's been sitting out here since 10 well i think we discovered the hole around 10 o'clock it is now a quarter after four and it's still just leaking gas so i had a full tank in there so there goes 40 dollars. but oh well we'll get it fixed we'll get her running i mean it runs it ran under its own power i mean nothing's wrong with it besides the gas tank leaking so it would drive home but it wouldn't be very safe it's probably not even safe with <laughs> the way it is but at least it looks cool but i hope you guys enjoyed the clips that i did get today if you did leave a thumbs up if you got any questions concerns whatever drop it in the comment section below and if you are new to the channel hit the subscribe button this sucks it's heartbreaking but easy fix